It is Foodie Friday, and this week we're featuring Anthony's. Steve is on the patio right now with executive chef Pat Donahue. Steve, I'm so excited to join you on the patio in just a few minutes. How are we doing out there? You're still working on the huckleberry sauce. It's going to be paired with our, one of their entrees. I love that we're getting into huckleberry season. That's right. I do too, and what a great Northwest staple, right? Mm -hmm. Executive Chef Pat Donahue, thank you so much for being with us today. It is a joy to have you. So we have quite the spread here this morning. Sort of to walk us through what we have from desserts to salads to the actual entrees here. Okay, like you said, we'll start with desserts. Okay, so, good man. So we'll, we'll we have a uh, wild mountain huckleberry slump. Okay. And this it's the same slump topping that we're just doing, that we were finishing up with our peaches. Okay. We do it with our huckleberries. We'll have a uh, huckleberry spinach salad with hazelnuts and blue cheese and a uh, huckleberry vinaigrette. Okay. Um, uh, our, our New York style cheesecake okay. with uh, wild mountain huckleberry sauce. And uh, you just finished this, this on the grill, yeah, right? So, so this is right off the grill. So this is off the grill. This is our silver salmon. Typically, we like to uh, cook our silver salmon on alder planks. Uh -huh. Okay. And why is that? Just because of a more rich flavor? The, the wood uh, imparts some flavor, but it also breathes and it makes it produces a very moist uh Piece Moist fish? piece of fish, okay. yes, yes. Right. But we also love the char grill on on the salmon as well. We'll char grill the silver as well, but okay. we, we love to char grill our king salmon, and this is a salmon medallion. And this now, what's is, all included with this here? Okay, so this is our uh, savory cornbread pudding. Okay. We make our own cornbread in-house, and we'll uh, toss it with onions, thyme, rosemary, and a little bit of jack cheese. And oh, interesting. Yes. Okay. And then, and then it's got the, the eggs and, and cream, and, and we bake that, and uh, it pairs beautifully with the huckleberries and, and our salmon. Just amazing. And you yes. were telling me, too, you've been with Anthony's for quite some time. Yeah. <laughs> oh, well, and you're kind of the, you're the head guy, right? Yeah. So you have a team that works under you. Yes, I have four uh, regional chefs that work with uh work directly with the chefs at the, in the stores. Okay. Uh, Tony Ring is our chef de cuisine and and we collaborate on dishes all the time. We talk through, we get ideas from oh, from just about anybody and yeah. our and our chefs, the store chefs, they okay. create. We have what's called a menu planning and we gather our ideas and we present them to a committee that uh, and uh, work through it with the chefs and see how we go about uh, producing it for our guests. During our last segment, you talked about, you know, why huckleberries, but what do you like about this pairing with this particular fruit in some of the, you know, the entrees or dishes that we're seeing here? First of all, I, I love, this fills a great gap because after peaches are in this, in the Northwest here, um, there's not a whole lot of choices for, um, fresh local that I can sink my teeth into yes <laughs> so so uh, that's why I love these huckleberries because you, it's so versatile uh, from desserts to drinks to entrees Put it right? just about anything just right? about anything yes. and we were talking about this sauce that's been simmering so where is this gonna go do you want to put that on oh, the entrees yes. there so is that ready to go yes this is all ready to go okay so we ha have our silver salmon salad with uh, market greens okay wild huckleberries and we just tie in beautiful a little bit of this doesn't that look scrumptious yeah so we're going to kind of get these uh, up. finished up here by adding some of that sauce i know holly's going to come down and join us and then we're going to what taste next yes does that sound okay yes so we can taste the difference between fresh wild king salmon char grilled and uh wild alaska uh, silver salmon. So we have kind of our, our, our finished product here, and should we start with dessert first? Well, do you want to start with yeah. the fish? Yeah, oh. I think we start with dessert. Take us okay. through again everything we're trying for those people just tuning in. Okay, so we have uh, the Anthony's uh, New York style creamy cheesecake. Delicious. With wild mountain huckleberry sauce. Are you just going to try a bite of that? Okay. Yeah, there we go. Slightly sweet, a little bit, and, yeah. and goes really well with. Do it. Get yours. Everything. Yes. That looks amazing. <laughs> okay, what else do okay. we have? There's another dessert. Now, our staple on our huckleberry program was is our huckleberry slump. So oh, just like the peach slump. Just like the peach Which slump. Which is so good. Yes, and the, this is our last weekend for the peach slump. Next week we will get into the uh, huckleberries. 
That's for our huckleberry soup. Oh, it's fantastic. That's so, so yummy. It has graham cracker and a little ginger on it. That's okay. so yummy. And oh, I'm going to dish you up. Is that all right? Do it. There okay. we go. With my green beans. What do you think of that one so far? Mm. Yeah. <laughs> that cheesecake's divine. I love it. The huckleberries have such a distinct taste, which I love about this menu and sort of the pairings that you guys have put together. Um, but really, I think anybody would love this combination. It's just so good. Yeah, they have that earthy uh, notes to them. Mm -hmm. Nice, intense blueberry, well, huckle huckleberry yeah. flavor. Yeah. So. And as yeah. you mentioned, such a history in the Northwest, too. I mean, I remember yes. growing up and picking huckleberries with my grandfather. Oh. We were one of those groups that would oh, go and very pick good. them and find them. So do you so have your favorite on? spot or your secret spot, I should say? Eastern Washington. Eastern, okay. Mm -hmm. So for short on okay. time, take a little test. Oh, we got to try it all. Part. That's delicious. That's <laughs> so fun. that's the char-grilled king salmon. And this one was uh, caught uh, at the mouth of the Columbia River mm. not too long ago. And we like to char grill that. And we do these medallions that are Pier 66 That's and some of uh, specific Anthony's. And really good drinks, too. This is our, oh, our Huckleberry Lemonade. And uh, cheers. 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 There That's we go. Good. Cheers to you, Oh, my chef. goodness. This is just Fantastic. Delicious. So again, what was this underneath real quick? Oh, that's a savory cornbread pudding. That was delicious, yep. too. It was. Yeah. So again, peach season yeah. coming to an end, mm -hmm. and all these are now available starting next week, right? Next week. Okay. Right. So check out your local Anthony's, and happy grilling, and happy weekend, and as we enjoy the last couple days yeah. of summer. Enjoy the huckleberries. Thank you so okay. much for coming in. That was wonderful. Yes. Thank you for inviting us. See yeah. you next week.